Hey everyone! Sorry, I look hideous, but Sona <laughs> looks amazing because we just did her makeup and um, she never has worn such warm... She, you just wear golden eyeshadows. <laughs> so I always wear neutral colors and she, she did this really pretty cranberry look. I'm a little scared to experiment with colors and thank you for oh like... God. like making me try this or else I would have never done it. For anyone who has like monoliths like her, I hope this like really is helpful. Mm -hmm. Please excuse my face. Stop leaving bad comments about it. <laughs> I can I can hear you type like my cat looks so dirty. Huh, so whatever. <laughs> I think you look stunning. Baby, you was looking good. <laughs> So yeah, that's it. Um, so if you guys want to know how I treated this on Sonal, then please keep on watching. Okay, so Sonal has a bare base. I am going to start by applying this serum. This is from Clarins. Uh, this is a double serum. I've been using it a lot lately, as you can tell. I've been trying this out. It's fairly new. Um, it's amazing. So I want Sonal to try it as well. So basically you can control the amount you want. If you want a lot, you like turn the knob around till here. And then if you want a little, you can turn the knob around. I'm going to take a lot, like one pump, like yep. so. I'm just going to quickly apply that all over your skin. It is very, very light and yeah. it just sits very well, like underneath makeup, I just feel. Mm -hmm. Hana? I, I have a sample. I didn't I haven't used it yet. What am I doing? I'm like petting you. <laughs> so we'll just let that settle in. Okay. We are not going to start with the base anyway. So that's gonna get like a nice time to settle in. I want you to apply a lip balm. This is the Bobbi Brown one. This is my favorite lip balm. I love this. I have like two backups already. I really like this. So we'll just apply that uh, while we do your eyes. So for eyes, I was thinking of using the Modern Renaissance palette. Um, she wanted to do like a nice cranberry eye. Um, and she always usually like goes for the neutrals. So we were thinking of doing like something. And that's what you wanted, yeah, right? I just want to try something different out. I usually only do golds and bronzy shades. Like I, uh -huh. go, I don't ever use any. Do you like anything from the this palette? I like. I knew you would choose that. Yeah. Do you want to do that only? Like, do you want? Yeah, this? we could do something like that. But can we tr make we it can, a little yeah, yeah. different and yeah, try this? I want to start by using the shade called Burnt Orange. Look down for me. Um, so I'm applying the shade Burnt Orange as a transition shade. She almost has a monolid, don't yeah. you? On the cuff, look straight for me. Yeah. So we're just gonna blend that. This is going to help, like, be a very nice soft transition. I'm just extending it outwards a little bit, mm -hmm. just so that your eyes look bigger. The colors blend so well from this Anastasia palette. Have you used it? No, no. No. I really like warm neutrals. I'm going to steal your Morphe palette someday. Yeah, please do. Please do. Then I am taking the shade Red Ochre. Oh, I forgot to mention what brush this was. We used the Pro Arte 217 brush. It's like a nice blending brush to apply uh, the transition shade. And now I'm going to apply the Red Ochre shade, which is like a nice match. Um, we're going to do the same thing, but slightly below where we applied Burnt Orange. I've never really worked with the eye shape like yours, so it's like a learning curve for me as well. Yeah. My eyes are really Look flat. straight for me. Yeah. Wait, uh, close your eyes. Look straight for me. Yeah, so this way I can just blend it into the crease. Yeah. Look straight. Yeah, this way I can like blend it straight into the crease like a really harsh yeah. crease. This is like really define your crease. I hope that was on focus. I'm gonna deepen it up a little bit. Ooh, that color looks so nice on you. I'm actually gonna go that side for your other eye. I actually don't. So I think in, on the left side, I have a slightly deeper crease than, that, than I have on the right. Uh-huh. 
I, I think it's the same for all of us, no? Yeah. Like we have. So but I think because my eyes are very yeah. flat, it's very prominent. Yeah, so I'm going in slightly deeper for your crease. And not blending it out too much. Mm -hmm. Put down. Because I really want your crease to be prominent. That's going to make your eyes look bigger. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I'm just going back with that same eyeshadow brush that I applied burnt orange with and just blending it. I think we're going with the shade called Calabar. This one right here. It's a beautiful cranberry shimmery shade. I know Sonal will really like this. Looks slightly up for me so that the shimmer doesn't fall all over your face. And I'm just starting here. <gasps> oh wow, such a beautiful shade. You're gonna love it. You should wear colors like this more often. I know, I, I'll start experimenting soon. I've just... Oh wow, that's such a beautiful shade. I don't know why you keep saying that you can't wear eyeshadow. This has a little bit of fallout. Mm -hmm. yeah, I haven't used this color yet. It seems to have a fallout. In the edges. So I don't have anything else on the brush. You look like you have someone punched you <laughs> underneath. Wow, these are crazy pigmented, dude. You have to apply so much pressure. Yeah, it's insane. And I have like created this nice little wing on the outside while I'm cleaning it. So that just helps with the shape. Yeah. You know, this, this part of your eye does not catch any pigment. I know, right? There's yeah, a problem. Yeah, there's a problem here. It's there's like some, a patch. Yeah, there's. I think something's wrong with my skin over there. It does not catch any pigment. See, it's like a. It's really irritating me this part. You will have to go over it with a little less pressure. I think. I think it's because there must be a glass cut over there. Oh no. So I don't know if you can tell, but I have like glass cuts here. Mm -hmm. If you look closely, there are oh. these shiny lines. So I think there's a glass cut over there. Using a darker color. This is called Ada. It's a nice matte shade. Wow, that's very pigmented. So I'm just going to connect it underneath. Oh wow, that is such a pretty shade. I haven't seen you in so much color ever. <laughs> Look up for me. Not hurting you, no? No. These are crazy pigmented. Amazing. Have you tried shadow shields? No. I've it's seen people use it a lot. I haven't. It's like this thing you I stick know. under. Yeah. You can use like panty liners as well. Yeah. Brilliant. So I'm going to use the pack highlighter on the inner corner right now. This is in the number? Number seven. I knew it was number seven. Really highlight your eyes. This instantly makes such a big difference. This is the NYX 4 Black Pencil in the shade Oxblood. Apply this on your uh, waterline. What? Have you ever applied a red eyeliner on your inner corner? Never. I've do you like it? Can you go in a little darker, like mess it around on your waterline? Water oh yeah, mess it on your waterline. So we're just applying the dark ox blood color very messily underneath the eyes. Now, so I'm just going to blend it. Look up for me. I'm going to blend it. Yeah, I think that's good. That's good. Good job, girl. Um, apply a very thin eyeliner, a uh, winged eyeliner, a very thin one, as close to your lash line. Hmm. This is the Schwing eyeliner from The Balm. I'm just going in slightly longer. I want to accentuate the eyes. I'm doing falsies. I think I should do falsies, no? Yeah, yeah. It will help. 
Yeah, I've I've made really long wings than you usually. Yeah. Wear. Hana? So we are done with the eyes. Let me put on some eyebrows for you. Let me draw on eyebrows for you. You know, I haven't done my eyebrows in six, seven months now. I can tell. Because I can see this growth coming in. But six, seven months, no. I thought like one month. No, I have ba so ba I barely had eyebrows. That's the reason why I had to let them grow out. I don't feel like making your eyebrows really dark, you know. I love doing other people's makeup. Just gives me like this zen kind of feeling. Do you like doing it for others? Yeah. I also like getting my makeup done. Yeah, <laughs> no? Fe it feels really nice. So I'm using the Gimme Brow. My hands are shaking so much. It's my right hand, no? Mm -hmm. That's why. Just Ooh, I've never done this. Never applied false eyelashes on someone else. I love false eyelashes. They instantly make everything fancy. Yeah, liner just to hide the lash band. Okay, so for base, mm -hmm. we are going to use your favorite, my favorite, thumbs up ka favorite. <laughs> this, this is, is like perfect skin in a bottle. I love this so much. So we are going to use the Estee Lauder double wear foundation i hate that it does not come with a pump though i know yeah why so difficult sometimes we end up wasting a little bit a little bit huh? yeah. and it's so expensive that i don't feel like wasting it hurts my soul it hurts a lot you don't even need concealer with this yeah much. no a little goes like a long way. Your skin is doing amazing. Really? Yeah, I remember like Beach May, it was like breaking out a lot. Oh yeah. Like not breaking out and she has a really dirty habit of pricking her pimples. Like she'll keep doing this on her skin. Don't touch your face, man. So I don't know, every time I feel like there's a dry crust on my skin, I feel like getting it off. Mm, that's when you get all this, <laughs> which this foundation is covering up so flawlessly. I know. So this is the brush I was telling you to use it with. Mm -hmm. This is the NYX Expert Foundation Brush, number four. It's the perfect stippling brush, just like stipples it in mm -hmm. so well. Do you like the finish? I do you do it, it differently? I use I use a beauty blender. But this works fine too. I don't like using beauty blenders these days, especially with like um, liquid foundation because I feel it eats up. Yes, most it, just, of it. it does. It definitely does take up a lot of like soaks in a lot of product. So especially when it comes to like expensive ones, I <laughs> usually like tend to avoid using it because I don't want to waste product. They're so expensive. I think that's beautiful. It matches you like a dream. Hannah? Yeah, this it's is perfect. It's perfect shade ever. I was using the wrong shade initially. Which one was it? Donnie. Oh. It's a little more, it's it's a little lighter than cashew. Okay. Let's use concealer. I'm gonna use honey for you. Look up. Just going in with dots, like so. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Is that how you do it? Yeah. Just gonna highlight the inside. Just highlight the face. This is the pack 0 to 0 brush. It's much smaller. Because I want to really clean up this area and brighten it. And a smaller brush gives you like more precision. It has eaten up the inner corner highlight. I'm just going to reapply that later. Look towards me. Just want to see if it's blended. Oh, dude, this blends like a dream. The concealer, no? Yeah. Yeah. What shade? Are is this using? honey? I think you should use honey instead yeah. of warm, medium, whatever you use. Warm, natural, yeah. Yeah, don't use warm, natural. I think get honey. Honey is much better for you. Warm natural is a little too light. Ashy on you. It's a little cool toned, yeah. It's a little more warmer. 
Use honey. I think it's the best for you. Look how nicely it's enhancing your under eye. Let's cover up that butt chin. <laughs> I'm gonna take a little bit on your lips. I feel it's very pigmented. Were you wearing something pink? Yeah. I have like a natural outline. But that I know, yeah. Oh, everybody's been really sweet about our random facts, by the oh, way. They, they, I haven't read the comments yet. Yeah, everybody's been really sweet. There are a bunch of really nice girls. They've been very uplifting and everything. So I'm just going to take the Nashio Loose Foundation. This is in the shade medium. Look up. Look up. Just <laughs> baking for a bit. Wow. It's nice. I've never no? baked before. You've never baked before? No. Nope. Amazing. So we're just going to bake that. Really want a nice matte finish. Pressing it into the skin. <laughs> we're being so serious today in our video. Yeah. It's a makeup one. It's like a serious makeup tutorial. It's a serious makeup tutorial. <laughs> There's gonna be no jokes. Yeah. We got done with the jokes in yesterday. <laughs> yesterday's video. No more jokes left in our. Okay, let's. More go. jokes next week. <laughs> next week. Stay tuned. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna use the Kat Von D um, Shade and Light palette, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna use this. Have you tried this before? No. Are you excited? Uh, I, I really like I, I I've tried it on you. Oh yeah, I remember. Yes. Dude, your eyes look stunning. Taking the shade right here in the center on an angled brush. Oh, she already has really pretty cheekbones. So I don't have to do much. Just gonna sculpt it a little bit. Because I want like a nice defined contour. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Do you contour your nose? Sometimes, yeah, when I do like a um, look that involves a lot of steps. Yeah, I'm just going to contour here to define that collarbone. So on top here. It's all fake. Nothing is true. You, did you put highlighter on your collarbones yeah. already? Yeah. When did you do that? Bef when you were setting things up. This, I'm like, why is it shiny already? <laughs> Let's take a bigger brush in. Sorry, we had to turn the fan off, so she's a little sweaty. So we're, yeah, that looks good. Um, I'm gonna apply blush. I'm gonna take Gingerly from MAC. I think it's gonna look lovely on you. Very pretty blush. Smile. <gasps> Whoa, that's pretty. So pigmented, dude. Mm -hmm. Nice and matte and pigmented. Scary. Please don't take a lot of it. it. Like build it up if you want. Smile for me. Wow. So pretty. So for highlighter, wow. we are going to apply the back highlighter, baked highlighter number seven. Prepare to explode. So pretty. Turn around. This this side of my cheek. Oh, mine. <laughs> Yours. But it's the same thing. Do you go all out like this? Yep. Sometimes. Oh, that looks so nice. Yeah. Let's apply a little bit on the brow bone. A little bit. Let's ex I'm gonna accentuate your butt chin because <laughs> I like it. So this is NYX lip lingerie in Capri Show. It's a really nice muted pink. I really love it. this. Reminds me of Hot Latte, but okay. So we're just left with lower eyelashes. I put this choker on her I don't know why I felt like and I think it looks nice it looks damn hot baby girl just applying some mascara on the lower lashes mm, I think we're done So 
so this is the finished look that's um i love it yay this is such a pretty color i'm i'm stealing that palette by the way it's Thank amazing you. take it yeah it's mine it's yours <laughs> <laughs> It's so nice. I think you should try colors a little bit more. I think you should come around more often yeah. like you do. Uh, let's do like a nice teal on you next yeah, time. Yeah, I love teal as a color. Yeah. It's one of my favorite colors. So let's do teal on you next. And I think this looks amazing. Have you, and the best part is that the, the off blood liner on your Oh nose. yes. I never, so I've never yeah. worn anything other than like black, black, blue or gray. This is the first time I've used like a ox blood liner in my waterline and it looks really nice it looks really, really stunning. stunning thank you it's your job you did a really good job we should see face but, uh, uh. please go subscribe to our channels um you can go subscribe to sonal i'm gonna leave the link down below you can subscribe to my channel in case you enjoyed this um and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you get notified every time she posts let's video. make sonal get that as well she's pretty close that right there i want sonal oh, to have it you're so sweet <laughs> I think I have highlighter on my cheek. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, you should keep a cabaret show with you. It looks really nice. This lipstick? You. Yeah, it's yours now. Thank you. I think, I think you have it already. already. <laughs> it's mine now. Cool. <laughs> Not yours anymore. Cool. I think we can end up talking. Yes, yes. <laughs> we will, oh, sorry. We, 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 we will keep talking. We'll do another video where we're chatting. So yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Bye-bye. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.